He thought it was over. If you thought it was over, it is not. I am flooding your timeline with Detroit Lions news and information because that is what I do. This was too intriguing to wait till tomorrow, so I decided to make a video tonight. And this is coming from NFL analyst and writer Cam Marino. Says, been told by a couple sources that Julian Okwara to the Giants is one to watch. And what is he referring to? Down here. Ari Mirov says NFL trades are likely to trickle in this week and next as front offices begin to figure out how they will assemble their 53 man roster. There has not been a single trade yet since all 32 two teams have been at camp. Now, this is very intriguing because we have talked about Julian Okwara. If he makes the team, could he be traded? We talked about the potential maybe about a month ago. Coming up, Julian's name was coming up in a trade for maybe Chase Young. Now, this is not the Washington Commanders, obviously. It is the New York Giants. But the question looms is, is, is this true? Okay. Is there any type of inkling or any type of trade brewing for the Detroit Lions and the New York Giants? Now, the Giants got a good look at Julian. And the Detroit Lions got a good look at someone else as well. But could this be for future draft capital? and or a potential player. And what position would that potential player play? Would it be a wide receiver? Would it be offensive tackle? Anybody on the O-line, a cornerback? I mean, the, the possibilities are endless. But is there any truth to the Detroit Lions, the New York Giants, trying to pull the trigger for a trade for Julian O'Quara? I think Julian's time with this team is over. And the Detroit Lions would be smart to try to get anything they could from him when it comes to draft capital. I myself would not mind this one bit. You guys know that Julian was under, he was a draft pick under the Matt Patricia era, Romeo. It, the ironic thing is, I believe that Romeo came from the New York Giants and his brother could end up going to the New York Giants. But if there is a player, if there is any truth to this, and this does happen before roster cutdown day, what player from the New York Giants would you want the Detroit Lions to target in a trade for or with, including Julian Okwara? Very interesting. Had to get this out tonight because I was like, man, this is a good one. If there's any truth to this, the 53 man roster, don't forget, cut down day is just one day now. We would have three cut down days before each being the Tuesday after the previous preseason game. But now it's just one all the cut downs will be made at one time. Is it possible that the Detroit Lions move Julian O this week? If they don't, I don't think that just because if it doesn't happen this week, I still think it could happen. Now what they would have to do is they would have to keep him on the 53-man roster, move somebody to the practice squad with the thought of trading him before we go to Kansas City. Whatever happens, I hope it happens this week because that way this individual if it is indeed a player along with some capital, this individual could be ready to face the Kansas City Chiefs because we're going to need all the firepower we can get, whether it is on offense or defense. So let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Do you believe that there's some truth to the New York Giants having their eye on Julian O'Quara? I believe the Lions will move on from him. And what player would you like them to target if this is true? Or would you just prefer draft capital for the upcoming NFL drafts? Let me know in the comments below. You guys are awesome. Take care of yourself and each other. And as always, go Lions. You thought it was over.